Parashak Media. And we fall into the Hydrocity Zone. Hello, I am Sonic Fanatic from Aurora Shock Media, and this is episode 2 of Let's Play Sonic the Hedgehog. Today I'm in the Hydrocity Zone, which is the main water level of Sonic 3 and Knuckles. And uh, let me just say straight off, when I was a kid, the water levels gave me the most torture just because of the drowning music. I used to always mute the TV when that music came up, so I was completely freaked out. But now that I'm older, I'm not terrified by it at all. And I'm going the upper route. I normally go down the lower route, but I'm gonna try something different today. And... Oh, budge. And... I gotta get that guy off me here, he'll suck away my rings. Fortunately, the only way to get him off is to roll, and I can't roll. So I need to find. A okay, that works. To jump down from the conveyor belt, or whatever that thing is called. So let's keep going, and. Oh, no! Get off! Okay, I'm too short for the bubble, and I can't roll, and I can't go anywhere else, so I'm gonna have to let myself die here. But what'll kill me first, drowning or the bot? It looks like I'm gonna drown. Yes, sir. The rings were still so encountered while I, while I was already dead. I wonder if I would have lost a second life if the rings hit zero. My game would have crashed if that happened. I'm gonna have to try that sometime. <laughs> but not today. So, anyway, let's just go the lower routes. Uh, I know it better, and I know exactly uh, where a big ring is. Speaking of big ring, I have three Chaos Emeralds, and I'm going for the next three. I can find three in this big stage. And I have a bubble shield, and if you remember in the last episode, I mentioned the bubble shield uh, that you breathe underwater. So you don't have to go for an air bubble. So that's a little neat little feature they had. And I like this little illusion here too, uh, where Sonic runs across the water. I think it's pretty cool. Chompers, jump over a third one. And someone didn't mention about the shields in the last episode. All three of them uh, deflect any uh, objects that are fired at you. So that's a le neat little thing about the shields. So really, all I'm doing right now is fighting the clock. But I'm near the end of the stage anyway. So, it's no big deal. Coming up right here is a big ring, and no! 
Let's get back there. Alright, there we go. And just for the sake of time, I'm going to speed this up. And that is Chaos Emerald number four. Means there's only three more left to find, and I could potentially get uh, two of them before this zone is done. And that's what I'm gonna try to do here. I gotta continue as well. Now, as soon as I hit the spring, it's gonna take me right to the mini boss. is the attacks. Uh, you can actually hit him with the bubble shield, but it's very risky. See right there? I think I got him, but I lost my shield. Now I know I got him because I, it only took four more hits to hit him, and it takes six hits for every mini boss, so I must have hit him. Get a ring box, and that's gonna be it for part one. And I'm gonna take a break, I'll be right back, but first, here's this uh, episode's trivia question.